hello and welcome to you it's for you so in this quick video i will show you guys how to set up a procedural way to find out which foot you stop for example if i stop on right foot you can see on print string right foot stop and if i stop on left foot similarly left foot stop is prints so this is not any hardcore logic for find out which foot you stop this is fully procedural way to find out which foot step you land when you stop and you can see in all directions i have proper output right foot stop or left foot stop and if i slow motion if i play in slow mo you can find out left foot stop and if i stop on right foot while moving left you can see it prints right foot stop so this is a fully procedural logic for finding out which foot you land which foot you land when you stop so let's get started guys so for making this i'm gonna open my animation blueprint and i'm gonna move the logic aside and rewrite the logic again so first thing when our we need to find when our character stops so for this i have created my variable for locomotion state you can use the velocity value or speed value for this so if i'm if my locomotion state is equal to idle only then i'm gonna find i need to know only then i need to know which foot i'm i'm landing so on true case i'm gonna use do once do once and reset at false so first thing first i'm gonna get my owning component and get socket location duplicate this node again so i'm gonna use my root bone and my right foot bone for this if i open my skeleton here is my root bone and here is my right foot where is this my right foot i'm gonna use these two bones for this so for i'm gonna at first i'm gonna use root and for second get socket location i'm gonna use foot underscore r so this will give me my socket location and give me the root location root bone location and foot r location and the next thing i'm gonna use find look at rotation between these two and if i'm gonna use draw debug coordinate system the location will be my root and the rotation will be this for duration i'm gonna use five second and thickness is one so if um, i'm gonna run this you can see wait there is something missing over here root foot r scale and i'm gonna set this scale to 150 you can see the rotation in red so if my foot step on foot is behind then the location is forward vector is behind so if my foot is forward you can see the location is in forward axis so we will use this information and next thing we need to find out the character rotation so for this i have my player character reference and i'm gonna 
use my get control rotation and next thing I'm gonna use my get velocity in which direction my velocity is and I'm gonna use the forward vector sorry I'm gonna use the forward vector for my control rotation and then I'm gonna search for find look at rotation between my control rotation and my velocity so here is my look at rotation and if I debug draw debug coordinate system again this one for this and 150 duration 51 so if I debug the get actor location for location and rotation you can see these two coordinate systems will give me will give the information so if both of these forward red one axis are in same direction this means we for the right foot stops so if they are in opposite direction which means left foot stop so we will use this information I'm gonna remove draw debug nodes and here is my find look at rotation of my root and foot are and here is the look at rotation between my control rotation and the velocity so I'm gonna use the forward vector Of these two and use the dot product so here's the dot product result and I'm gonna use print string and use the select node so if my dot product result is greater than zero which means our right foot stop and if this is less than zero which means our right left foot stop I'm gonna use right foot stop so if this is less than zero then left foot stop so if I run this you can see the result is pretty amazing and procedural and this happens in all direction you don't need to find don't need any hardcore logic for uh, for finding out the which foot you land so this is a fully procedural way you can use to find out right foot stop or left foot stop so i hope you guys like this video and don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel and also you guys can support me on patreon and gain access to all my project files over there and communicate me over there thank you guys and see you in the next one